I'm very excited to report that House Bill 1557 has passed the House, and um, it's an initiative that's very important to me because uh, I'm working with job creators in my area, and this is something that's been recognized is that sometimes state government has arbitrary deadlines and red tape that make it harder to create jobs and harder to weather economic downturns. Last year I authored a bill that would allow coal operators to, uh, to stay open uh, even if they have to temporarily cease operations due to a market downturn. Uh, that legislation passed the House and then we were able to work with the DEP to get those initiatives implemented through regulation. We recognize that there's another part of the law uh, that deals with coal refuse disposal sites. These are areas where we take rock from that's been, that's been mined um, and we use it to mitigate uh, legacy coal mining problems. Um, but these sites also need that similar uh, tweak in the law to allow them to stay open despite a temporary pause in operations. So I've been able to work with uh, our, our job creators as well as the administration and the Department of Environmental Protection to achieve uh, wide support. And I'm very excited to move this bill forward through the Senate. Overall, what this is about is cutting red tape to be able to allow us to save and create jobs.